this cake. Welcome to Girlfriend to a Narcissist 101. Thank you for joining me. I haven't subscribed. Please do. Don't forget to like and share as well. Guys, so this topic is how the covert narcissist's high expectations for the kids exposes them. How the covert narcissist's high expectations where the kids are concerned exposes the covert narcissist. Now, guys, whether the covert narcissist sticks around or they took off and left you with the children, the result, the summary is still the same, where the kids are your problem. The kids are your, uh, they're doing you a favor. Literally, they're doing you a favor by being, having any kind of involvement or the, the, for the fact that they disappeared. That is your problem. That's pretty much what they're telling you, you know. So when they do stick around, they have, the covert narcissist has, um, uh, I guess, preferred kind of a relationship they want to have with the kids where is is a role reversal kind of thing where the child is now the parent and the covert narcissist is is, is the child but it's in certain situations that they, they want that to flip-flop around how it's convenient for them so it's not like it's the same all through the board all across the board where they are the kids and the kid the children are the parents no you know they still want the kids to um give them the same respect uh, as you, uh, a child will give uh, a parent, but at the same time, uh, treat them like children too when it's convenient for them. You know, so uh, the ch the child is is a role reversal thing. You know, they they are their parents so, so sometimes, and uh, when it's convenient for the covert narcissist, uh, they, they become the, the children. You know, that's just you know how it how it's set up. How they prefer it to set us. How they prefer it to uh, be set up between them and the kid. So. The expectation they will not have, you know, towards the children is where, like I said, they look at the kid as a parent, you know, where um, the things that the parents are supposed to do for the child, they're expecting the child to do for them. You know, and I'll give you an example. I told you guys uh, in, in a past video that the covert narcissist goes to the kids for uh, like um, two weeks. Finally showed up uh, last weekend. All of a sudden, I picked them up and spent the weekend and the whole time. Uh, he was over they were over there when the kids came back uh my son kept, he said he kept going back and forth on how why did they not even check in on him and they you know that he he didn't talk to them for your father didn't call you for like uh <laughs> three weeks uh and and you didn't even try to find out what's going on with me you know do you guys even care you know so this is what he's telling you know th these kids that he didn't check up on the kids that suppose one of them had a COVID at that time, he didn't check up on them. So he's asking them why they did not call to check up on him when they didn't hear from him, because uh, that means they don't care. You know, they don't care. So when they, you know, the kids are telling me this and when they came back and, and I would just listen like, wow. Then my son was like, so what he's starting to tell us is that he doesn't care either because if we didn't check up on him and he didn't check up on us, that means he didn't care. I said, okay, <laughs> you know, so that's my, my, my daughter was like, yeah, I guess that's what that means. You know, since, you know, that's what he said that we didn't check up on him. That means we don't care about him. So since he didn't check up on us, that means he doesn't care about us, you know? So the covert narcissist would eventually expose themselves like this, you know, like you don't even have to say anything. You don't have to do anything just by that act alone. You know, see, they feel justified in, in making that statement. He feels justified making that statement. Why does he feel justified making that statement to uh, a 13 year old and a 10 year old? Why? Because they are the parents. He is the kid here. You know, he is the kids here. They are the parents that are supposed to be looking out for him, making sure he's fed, making sure he made it home on time. You know, he, he got home from school on time, got home from work on time. You know, so that's why he feels justified making that statement. Do you guys even care? You didn't check up on me. You haven't heard from me in three weeks. You guys even care, even though he knew that there was one of them was sick, you know, so he feels justified doing this because the covert narcissist will want to have a role reversal with the children where they are the, you know, the kids and the, the children are the parents. Doesn't matter how old the kids are, does not matter how old the kids are. They have the same expectations of you have to check up on me, you have to look for me, you have to wonder where I'm doing. And the same thing happens, you know, when the covert narcissist takes off and abandons the children with you. They actually expect the children to be out there seeking them out. You know, so like every day they'll be on the project, on the hunt of, oh, I'm trying to find my mom, I'm trying to find my dad. That is what, that is what they expect, you know. And then they stick around, the kids are supposedly constantly reaching out to them. 
you know and if they they make any kind of child support payment or whatever this actually makes it make, makes them feel more entitled to the fact that these kids owe them to be looking for them they owe them for them to be the ones making sure that they're okay making sure that they're fair making sure that they're healthy you know is the is the kids job now is the kids job the current narcissist wants a role reversal with the children whenever whenever it's convenient and they feel justified doing this and even if they and if they're making payment they even feel more entitled to how this arrangement is supposed to set up it does not matter how old the kids are all right guys get ahead of your mind and everything to fall into place please like and share take care